for their initiative. I'm indeed most delighted to be present here among you on this very important function, which also commemorates the long-lasting relationship more than 60 years between our two countries and peoples. For the past 60 years, the Thai citizens and our friends from Israel have always felt a sense of companionship and goodwill. This is not only represented in how many visitors we have between each other, but also in how Thailand and Israel have been partners in progress, science, education, and many other areas that have come to define our contributions to the world community. One such area that is close to the hearts of both our people is sustainable agriculture. Thailand is very proud to have the royal reign or what the world knows as an effective way of making artificial rain pioneered and internationally patented by His Majesty the King of Thailand. For decades, this local technology has provided all of us hope to Thai farmers. And even during this year's unusually dry rain season, the Royal Rain Unit under the Ministry of Agriculture and Cooperatives has been performing its duties. across the whole kingdom. Likewise, in Israel, groundbreaking technological innovations in the area of agriculture and irrigation have been able to turn desert into green areas, as we all know, making the country one of the most agricultural productive in the world. Because of its success, Israel's drip irrigation system is now ineffective after by many countries. That is why I'm delighted to mention how this teaching of technology has been presented by our most beloved, His Majesty King Pumipon Adulidit of Thailand in the development of Kuprapong Corporation Project located in Cha'am district of Prajop Kiri Khan province. Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, I very much hope that our honorable guests and participants are enjoying this great experience once again allowing me to convey my appreciation to the Thai Israel Finland Friendship Club for the support staff and business sector from Thailand and Israel have been generous in contributing to the success of this very special event. I'm also most delighted to say many friends from the entertainment industry and creative artists who have given their full support for this evening's presentation. We are gathered here to honor Her Royal Highness Princess Mahajakri Surin Thorn through our commemoration of a gene and friendship that contributes to development, progress, and peace for all. At this auspicious time, on behalf of the Royal Thai Government, may I have the privilege to declare opening the celebration to honor Her Royal Highness Princess Mahajakri Surin Thorn's 60th birthday anniversary and express 
my congratulations on the 60 years of friendship between Thailand and the State of Israel. Excellencies, the Ambassador, Tan Oranut Raiwa, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Next, we would like to invite the president of the Thai Israel Finland Club, uh, excuse me, Thai Israel Finland Friendship Club, Miss Aranut Raiwa, to, to be invited on stage to present her token to Mom Luong, Panada Bisakun, chairman of the event as well. Next, I would like to kindly invite Vice President of Central World. Mr. Isaret Jirachiwat to present his token of appreciation to the chairman of the event today. Thank you very much once again, uh, Mom Luok. Papanada Disakun, Minister attached to the Prime Minister's Office, Permanent Secretary of the Prime Minister's Office. ค่ะและในเวลาต่อไปนะคะขอเอ่อทุกท่านยังคงเยือนอยู่ด้วยกันบนเวทีแล้วก็ขอเชิญคณะกรรมการชมรมมิตรภาพไทยอิสราเอล